Hello my crafty friends, it's Lynn with uh, Scrapbook Sundries and I am here tonight with you uh, to give you a 12 by 12 uh, pad uh, de-stash and uh, coordinating cardstock. Look at all that pretty cardstock back there. So we're going to whip through this really quick. Uh, what I've done is I've got four uh, Craft Smith paper pads that I have used some of and now I'm going to de-stash the rest of them. And I've put on the front page, uh, on the front cover, exactly how many pages I have used. And obviously this uh, Blue Blooms, you can tell, was one of my favorite paper pads. I just love the coloring in here. So we're going to go through this really quickly. Okay, so you can see there is still life in this paper pad. Um, we've got uh, some beautiful uh, lavender. I, you can't see the lavender background too good. Whoops, I'm going to have to try to go through this up here better. Okay, because I'm one-handed. Okay, so we've got purple, and here is blue. So there's purples, blues, pinks, lots of foiling. That's one of the things I love about um, Craftsmith is they always put foiling in their paper pads. Isn't that gorgeous? This is one of my favorite pages out of this paper pad. Uh, the roses in a pink trailing down. Stripes. Oh, look at this rose gold foiling. Uh, just beautiful. Well, no, I mean it's gold, but it's on a rose background. Excuse me. <laughs> Here is the uh, here's navy navy blue. Look at the detail in these. Isn't it beautiful? Once again here, matching to go with it, pinks and blues. And look at this one, this chalky look. Isn't that gorgeous? And this black background. Here is uh, some cut apart. A whole page. Once again, look at the foiling. Always the foiling really makes your pages pop when you're making your scrapbooking or journals. Here's uh, that navy blue trailing roses. Here's the, the pink background. Oh, look at this with the um, foiling of the leaves. Just makes it pop, doesn't it? And here's that same page uh, with the blue and white instead of the pink and the foiling. Really beautiful. There's a pink flowers. Here's a big, huge page. Right? Very nice looking. Take time to make your soul happy. And then we have uh, these blue and gray leaves. Here are the pink roses. Some uh, striped for a good pattern background. The border trim. Oh, just lovely. Look at that. Just gorgeous. If you guys have seen this paper bag, you know it is beautiful. And then we have the gold foiling in this pattern. There's two of those. Okay, so that is this paper pad, Blue Blooms. And then we have the conservatory. And I only used a dozen of pages in this one, so 36 left. Turn it sideways here and try and pop it open. Okay, so we have uh, quite a few more of these, so there's double of these um, kind of peachy colored polka dots, and here is some 6x6 six six journal cards, or, or just, uh, I used um, this, this, this one right here, I put on uh, the front cover of a book and then embellished the heck out of it, so it came out gorgeous. Here is some ombre effect in pink. And um, let's see, I'm trying to bring down the next page. There we go. And this this pattern, you can't really see it unless you get up on it, but look, butterflies. Yep, gorgeous. And we have some pink, uh, pink, pink, pinks, reds, purples, flowers, butterflies. Look at this one on the this black background. Dream big, just beautiful. More butterflies. Here's a nice big page of butterflies. Here's a real um, gorgeous wreath. Just beautiful. And then we have the alpha. Okay, and look, they've all got little butterflies and gold foiling on them. You get one of those because I already used one page. <laughs> a plethora of butterflies. Here's some more of that same pattern we've seen in the um, pink. Two of these, okay, and we have two of these, the chocolate brown with the gold dots, and we have a scalloped border pattern, 
more flowers. This one's got purple in it this time. There's the borders again. And you can see, once again, there's foiling. Lots of beautiful foiling. This uh, paper pad truly, truly is, uh, does it justice to the conservatory. <laughs> Here's a gray, uh, kind of, you can see they're kind of like a, I don't know, faded uh, dots. Really pretty. We've got a blue, uh, no, it's uh, kind of like a green and blue. It goes from like a pale green to a pale lavender up there. Really unique ombre effect. There's more scallop, but in a kind of a, a muted gray tone. Once again, some more cut apart, gold foiling. So, 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 so pretty. The things you can make with this paper pad are just amazing. Here, there's the butterflies, this time on a back, black background. And once again, the flowers and butterflies on a black background. And more cut aparts. This one has so many. Look at this. Look at that one right there. Just beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so um, 36 of those. And then we have the Feeling Naughty paper pad. 14 of these, so you still have 34 left. And uh, this one I wasn't uh, too impressed with. Uh, I'm not really into big colors, but there was a couple of pages that I really wanted out of here. So we have some pink ombre, then um, pink sea life, you know, under the sea, um, sea horses, two pages of that in a bright blue. We have this uh, under the sea, um, and then we have some, I'm thinking these are three by fives, maybe, three by fours, three by fives, something like that. Look at that. Real pretty. Pink anchors, white anchors on a pink background. We've got lots of stripes in here, and they're brushed stripes. Really nautical looking, right? Look at this. Gold foiling with anchors. Then we have the sea urchin stuff. More stripes, uh, brushed pink. Here are some cut aparts. Look at that one. That was huge. There's mermaid. Really cute. These, uh, this, these pages look like the scales on the mermaid's um, tail, right? There's some seahorses, uh, gold foiling striped. Here's two pages of uh, the mermaids. Real bright, colorful. This would be perfect for a girl. All right, there's two of those. Every day is a new adventure. Here's some more of the border trim. Gorgeous, gorgeous. You can see the gold foiling. I hope I'm not going too fast for you guys. And uh, I can't. Then there's two of those pink ones that just came down together. Uh, oops, nope, there's that one. So we must have missed one. So let me go back. What was it? Come on. Oh, the blue anchors. Okay. And then this one. Look at this beautiful ombre gold foiled seahorses. Just beautiful. Okay, then we have the blue under the sea. And more cut aparts, right? Cute little, cute little mermaids. Got the blue ombre, and then we have this pink, red, and teal sea urchin. And then we have number four, Marrakesh. Okay, so I used 18 out of this one, so there's still 30 left. And this one is, other than the um, blue blooms, this one is another one of my favorites because I love pink and purple, you guys. Look at that. So beautiful, so beautiful, and the detailing in this one is gorgeous. There's the Moroccan lattice work, so pretty. And then we have the cut aparts, lots of wonderful motivating phrases. Once again, the gold foiling, so beautiful on those borders. This has a border at the top and the bottom, gold foiling once again. Look at the detail work on this, starburst. Um, here is a wreath, keep up the good, and there's two of those, good vibes. A marbling effect, once again, more cut aparts. Just beautiful. And the detailing in here, just look at that, so pretty. So pretty, more gold foiling. These starbursts, I cut these out and put them on cards. They're so pretty. Gold foiling again. Flowers. 
here we have a foiled marble luck two of those and once again we have that intricate detailed work in the purples and lavenders look at that gorgeous gorgeous okay so those are the four paper packs then you're getting this whole array of 12 by 12 cardstock okay so you're getting 30 of the 12 by 12 and you can see it goes from pinks to pales and then blues and greens and then you have three glittered and this is not the cheap stuff this is really nice so it doesn't come off on your fingers then you have these five uh eight and a half by eleven cardstock in these bright colors so there's ten of these which i thought would go great with the um uh, uh feeling naughty uh paper pad Okay, so you're also going to get, just to sweeten the deal, all right, some uh, thingy of, uh, I've mean, got the wrong hand going on here, uh, paper clips and colors and binder clips, uh, uh, different types of, of uh, um, decorations in there as well, gold, so you get that whole thing. Then you get this uh, baggie full of all kinds of little goodies, okay, whoops, and our washi tape's trying to get away. Um, we've got bicycles, washi tape, um, which you do have a bicycle right here. We've got some butterflies, some uh, bird cages, some uh, brass little findings, some clothes pins, some, some epoxy flowers with bling in the center in pink and turquoise and uh, monarch butterfly. And then I also have a roll of this double-sided sticky tape and you're also going to get four packs of the heart bling in red clear pink and lavender and last but not least nouveau this is the new pure shine um sapphire glitter isn't it gorgeous i thought it would look so good with this paper pack i have two of these and i took off the label because i like to see my glitter um so but it is nouveau okay and um that's going to come with it. So this is your little bonus. All right. So this D stash, okay, is $37. Yes, all of it together. That includes shipping. Okay. So if you're interested, reply below and let me know. And it is going to be PayPal only, friends and family, USA. $37 shipped. Okay. And that's going to come in a medium priority box. Have a great evening, you guys. Thanks for watching. Bye.